what's up guys average kiwi guy here how y'all doing so i'm a busy man at the moment i got a lot of final fantasy 14 stuff but i had to uh fit in some death stranding um the release date trailer came out today uh, apparently mads mickelson steals the show some crazy ass shit happens we actually kind of see what we're doing in this game so that's kind of my hope with these trailers is that we realize what the hell we're doing because <laughs> that's that's what it is man like this what it's come to it's like can we just figure out what the hell we're doing that'd be nice um and also to get uh a release date uh is huge so let's see what the hell is going on let's see that release date and let's see if i am still psyched to play death stranding <laughs> all right let's have a look three two one go how are we doing the baby thing again and we're going oh, Dude, man, M Mads Mikkelsen's a boss, man. Love him as an actor. It's the blood and stuff. No Together, you, you can help us we get a motorbike! Are you kidding me? Woo! Better than running, everyone. Sam, if we don't all come together again, humanity will not survive. We don't need so this is America, damn. Not anymore. We do. Alone, we have no future. Bridget, you're the president of Jack shit. <laughs> okay, so he knows the president enough. Bridges. Freaking Kojima. Yeah, it was like high tech crazy shit. Has this got like floaty powers? Oh, UI stuff? Go! Extender ladder! Whoa! Wonder if that's in set places or if we can do that anywhere. Like that. Like can we do that anywhere? That would be insane. It's all to safeguard the continued Ooh. independence of Edge Nut City. They want the UCA to leave me be. Edge Nut City? Again? Homo demons. Militant separatist group. Oh. I've heard of them. Bunch of terrorists oh. who go around towns killing people and leaving craters. Right. Nothing's off limits for them. Troy Not Baker. Even engineering void outs. There are extremists like the demons everywhere. Plotting in the shadows. Okay. So that called demons. Oh. We got scanned. So this is a stealth part. And there's like factions and everything? That's cool. Oh shit! They spotted us. Run! Run! Throwing spears? Oh! Ow! Gotta pick up my shit. I'm the UPS guy. Must deliver. Oh! UPS guy that can fight. Hell yeah! That bike is awesome. Oh, popping a wheelie and everything. Good thing it was raining. Even they know better than to mess with BTs. I can't spot BTs. Just sense them. Oh. That's why we came prepared. A bridge baby, huh? Makes me feel like shit every time. Well, you are plugging into the other side. Whoa. Too. 
The bridge baby? So that's what those things are. And they're connecting with the other side. Oh. Those look like ghosts. Like people. Oh shit. Oh shit. So other side, do you mean like maybe like death? Like death stranding, right? Those bound to Hades. I'm looking like underworld shit. It's a motherfucking World War One tank. Oh. Does Mads Mickelson control the dead? Is Mads Mickelson Hades? Oh, guns. Okay. Oh, they're creepy as hell. Uh-uh. No crazy doll babies. No. So that's his wife. Mama. Look at this cast, man. It's crazy. Pigs. Whoa. Ah, uh -uh. no, 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 no. No. And finish what Emily started. Starting to look like Loki. Yeah, when he's all frost giant -y. Why is there still a round us? No escaping it. But at least we'll have hope. So, like, maybe you get too infected, so you gotta, like... Because he, like, resets, right? You see, I've come to understand the truth of the Death Stranding. The Death Stranding. Oh, it's so hard to form connections when you can't shake hands. Oh. Fortunately, I've got a good connection to the other side. What the shit? They're like demon black ops off skeleton black ops officers. Covering the world in cable didn't bring an end to Warren's suffering. Don't act surprised when it all comes November to eight. To do Holy shit. Humans aren't made for living alone. They're supposed to come together to help one another. So she's going to be like, and if we as a people can't do that, like a ghost thing, reconnect. That's what we need right now, not to stand apart, but to come together. I'll show you the real thing soon. I promise. Whoa. Dude, they, they freaking go to the moon. This this game is off the chain. I don't know. Fuck me. November 8th. Holy shit. PlayStation. Alright. <laughs> Mads Mikkelsen is awesome, by the way. Mads Mikkelsen just... Every time, like, 
he, he, he just like every time he's he was in the scene like you just like focus on that um so he he was a great choice to do this sort of thing but how like it's definitely like the whole death stranding thing right it was like because up till now it's it those beings like those sort of shadow beings that like they have to hold their breath and they're like stand real still and stuff and they seem like aliens but maybe they're like underworld ghost things that's 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 how i'm seeing it now um they definitely wanted to try and push us in a direction that we kind of now we're starting to understand it um kashima does do, do this like he comes out with batshit crazy things and then he starts to lead you to his train of thinking and like by the time the game comes out you're kind of on the same page not all, not the same page because you'll never be on the same page as kojima but <laughs> it, it's you, you get kind of what's going on to enjoy the game so um so it's like some crazy high-tech stuff bridge babies so they're like a way of connecting between like life and death maybe because maybe they're not born yet so they're like a, a link between the two and they're, they're probably like specially you know created for that purpose um and that that allows them to see these ghosts and stuff and then that world war one scene where there's like world war one tank rolling through and like soldiers and stuff and then like mads mickelson coming out of the freaking ooze with all these soldiers and things and then at the end with him like with the cigarette and like this black ops looks like in like almost like behind enemy lines like coming out of the ooze and like you know you hear all this war stuff going on and you know he gets his like he's like he's got his black ops buddies with him and they're skeletons it's like what the hell like is mads mickelson can control the dead it's like is he hades uh his name was cliff but maybe he's like because he had that weird glowing thing on his stomach so maybe he's like connected fully with like the like the underworld or the death side or whatever you want to call it so like he's like fully enveloped by it and he seems to like be able to control it somehow that like, a little bit like those like uh troy baker's character seems to have some type of control over this the, like the the death side like he even says like i've got a real good connection with the death side so like i'm good um and like he created that shadow beast thing you know you remember in like in the one of the previous trailers he created like this giant shadow beast thing with a mask it was really cool looking um i mean i feel like i know more now but i have so many more questions now <laughs> which i guess is a good thing because like it keeps you interested in the game and like all the rest of it um but anyway, like, the actual gameplay stuff we saw, um, first of all, I'm glad we're not running everywhere. Like, we got the bike. Um, we, 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 we do seem to be running in wide open places quite a bit, though. So maybe you don't get the bike all the time. Um, I loved, like, the, get the gadget things, like the ladder and stuff. Like, you could put the ladder to go over big, um, like, areas and shit, like, you know like, crev like crevices and stuff and like you know oh, i need to go up there so you just put the ladder up and stuff um hopefully you kind of have free reign on how you use that um obviously you'd need you know the right places but like you could do it like anywhere along that cliff face and stuff like it's not just like a, a qte thing like you go to a certain point then it allows you to do it and stuff like it's very controlled um i like a little bit of free will on that um and like the the sort of the abseiling thing and stuff you know going the climbing rope it's kind of cool it's really really cool actually um kind of the whole tech side of it, it's very very interesting like it's very high tech but still got a little bit of um uh like sort of post-apocalyptic in a way like the suits are kind of 
kind of weird and like the sort of like contamination suits and stuff is very interesting so I, I do dig it i do dig it um so this is america this is america um because like you had the president there like that sick lady was the president so that's interesting um norman readers didn't give a give, give a shit that it was the president he's like you're the president of nothing <laughs> you're president of crap <laughs> like, i was like okay cool <laughs> um the game looks beautiful by the way like the grass the scenery um honestly like i am kind of surprised and and this is all going to depend on like sony like with their announcement of ps5 and stuff it, obviously like if it doesn't come out with the ps5 like say some crazy thing happens and ps5 comes out around the same time as this at the end of the year which i don't think so but like imagine it did like it would be kind of crazy um to have this as a launch title it'd be really really cool um but i imagine this will get like a ps5 version uh which you know has far better like graphics and fps and all the rest of it like it will just be a thing so because i honestly did think they were going to wait for the ps5 i thought this was going to get delayed no, well, not delayed, but, like, put off for a little bit longer. Um, so, yeah. Like, I, I was... I was... Actually thinking, like, this was going to be next year. When the PS5 is probably going to come out. So, mm. Um, but it still looks great. Still looks awesome. Like, I think this will push the PS4 to its limits. It will. It will push the PS4 to its limits um so we had some combat like some hand-to-hand -hand combat and stuff um looked all right looked fine like it looks like it's got a bit of um like you can grab objects and swing them and it changes your fight style a little bit i don't think it's going to be too like i think it's be maybe like it'll be a pretty typical melee combat it won't be anything too in-depth in any way um i'm wondering if there's like a trait system that you can go into like can you spec your guy out in different what ways like more stealthy better with firearms because we saw the gun part like maybe with a bit more um uh you know maybe more suited to like melee combat or like sensing the um like the the bts and stuff i don't know like that stuff we haven't seen yet um and if it is there that'd be cool um, I do like how there's, like, different factions, though. Like, it seems like different towns are just, like, nah, the, we're, we're, we're independent now. Like, we're, we're for ourselves. Um, and they seem to, like, just go out and, like, scavenge things and, like, try and take from people. And obviously, these bridges are guys, you know, br building bridges between settlements. Like, that's kind of the whole thing. Because that's what Kojima's been saying. Like, you're connecting people so like you literally are like the ups guy like you are the the um you know you're the mailman you're, you're g getting things from place to place and connecting those two together through <laughs> rain hail shine you're doing it <laughs> or dead people or bts or whatever you're you're getting that package to them um and then obviously these guys are gonna try and steal it uh which is interesting um the whole baby thing um they definitely explained that a little bit more i we did go into it a bit um i don't need the the creepy doll baby things uh-uh uh-uh no 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 none of that none of that i i i'm not i'm not about that life i'm not about that life um it is interesting at the end there where he went blue and he's basically like you know pointing the gun at himself like maybe he's like because like there is like a whole reset thing with these with him right like that we've seen him like you know they the craters and stuff like people blow up like it, it creates a huge explosion when i think these like the dead and the living come together or something like it seems like the bts and the living come together like some crazy thing happens so i wonder if that's still a thing um and then yeah just the craziness at the end um 
I think the whole like the Mads Mickelson in the lab I think that's going to be like flashback things uh, I think that's going to be like flashback things so like before he got like corrupted or before he like kind of became what he is um and through the main part of the game i think that's going to be like a flashback thing but dude um i'm excited i'm very excited for this game um it, it will be interesting to see if it can meet the like craziness hype like people are expecting some mind-blowing story and stuff like that so i'm wondering if it will meet that I, it is going to be an interesting thing. It's going to be a very interesting thing. Um, I am... Um, uh, 8th of November. So it's definitely going to fall... Uh, yeah, obviously before the whole um, holiday rush and stuff. Uh, be after the October rush... So it's definitely going to be a part of that, like, that sort of October, November block where, you know, a whole bunch of games come out. Um, I wonder what the length of this is going to be. Because they kind of hinted at, like, I'm going to show you the world. You know, a very, and you can explore all of it. Like, a vast world. And, like, in, like, even the moon. I'm like, this thing goes to the moon. What the, <laughs> it'd be crazy as hell. Crazy as hell. Um... But yeah, no, nah, that was a great trailer. A great trailer. It 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 explained things, but also left you with questions. So, a a good balance, a very good balance. But yeah, and Mads Mikkelsen is awesome. He's awesome. <laughs> All right, guys, that's gonna be it for us. Thank you very much for watching. I appreciate it. Um basically the channel at the moment is going to be taken up with a lot of final fantasy 14 stuff so if you are into that make sure you check it all out uh all the sort of details on all the job changes and stuff came out uh yesterday so i am kind of in the process of going through them all and sort of just taking away everything uh so we'll be having a bunch of videos going up for that sort of over the next couple of days as i can make them um I'm very excited for the, the new expansion coming out uh, in less, well, pretty much a month away now. So, actually, no, less than a month now. <gasps> By a couple of days. So, that's cool. Uh, also, E3, I'm going to be uh, checking out all the E3 stuff, all the trailers, um, and even, like, checking out the, um, like, sort of going over the conferences and stuff a little bit. Um, we'll see how I handle the, what I'm going to do with the E3 content and stuff. Uh, we'll definitely be doing trailer reactions, that's, that's for sure. Um, but the E3 conferences themselves, I'll figure out what I want to do on that. Um, but yeah, so if you want to keep up to date with all of that, hit that subscribe button. Uh, it's a good way to sort of pick and choose what you like from me, but you'll get everything. Um, it's, it, we're, we're a growing channel. So all the, all the, all the subs helps, all the things, are, um, are very, very much appreciated. Uh, big welcome to all the new subs. We've been on a bit of a sub roll. Um, we broke 2800 which is pretty cool um pushing for that 3000 pushing for that 3000 that'd be a really cool uh sort of thing to hit um yeah awesome thank you guys uh thank you for hanging out with me and i'll catch you next time peace bye